653, welcome back. Cystic fibrosis causes persistent lung infections, limiting a, a person's ability to breathe over time. Only about 30,000 people in the U.S. have the genetic disease, according to the CF Foundation. Some say a cure could be found in our lifetime, and you can help make that possible. It's hard to see a child hooked up to a machine. I just went to my husband and, you know, told him and started crying and said, you know, he's he's going to die young. Kaylina Ronksley received the devastating news of her son Jude's cystic fibrosis diagnosis when he was five weeks old. But I know the Internet's a scary place to look up information. Where do I start with what's accurate and what's made up? And she said, go to Cystic Fibrosis Foundation. <gasps> there are stories from parents and research leading to a prescription provided hope. They came up with that, this new life-changing drug, Prykafta, and that has totally transformed so many people's lives with, with CF. It's not a cure. It's still not a perfect solution, but just that alone has just totally changed the game. Each dollar being raised at the foundation is making a difference. How can we reduce infections? How can we support people post lung transplant and how can we support people that are having all of these other issues that have to deal with their CF started by parents more than 60 years ago. Their end goal remains the same right now. CF stands for cystic fibrosis, but in the near future, I really hope and believe that it will stand for cure found. One thing that has changed how much closer they are to realizing it. You can't thank anybody enough for saving your child's life. The best words. The Wichita Great Strides Walk is happening this Saturday. Money raised will help the Cystic Fibrosis Foundation in continuing to fund research and find a cure. We have a link to sign up for that walk at KSN.com. I love the line about uh, CS sound st standing for cystic fibrosis, but I'm um, hoping that it, it stands for cure found. Yeah, he, Jude's mom is a nurse, mm -hmm. and so it just, I think, tied in a different element to what she was experiencing and going through, and also a little bit of that hope that she has, uh, and I won't say a little, a lot of that hope that she has and in, in just the calmness that she got from the CF Foundation. And the Foundation has a lot of information on the website, as you said in the story, mm -hmm. but I'm sure a lot of parents seeing this parent, they can connect with her and if they have any questions, they'll know exactly where to go. Oh, yeah. And with Jude, I mean, come on, that bow tie. How sweet is he? <laughs> yeah, <I love laughs> Best that. dressed interview. Exactly. <laughs>